heavy rain this afternoon drenched the crops on Honeybrook Organic Farm in Pennington. Farm manager Sherry Dudas says enough is enough. It's really creating some major problems in the field. The National Weather Service in Mount Holly says so far it's been an abnormally wet June for the Trenton area. To date, the rainfall has been 6.71 inches. That's four inches above normal. Well, the first thing that a lot of rain means is that you don't have a lot of sun. So it is really um, adversely impacting plant growth. Also, it makes it harder for us to get out into the fields when they're sopping wet. So our uh, heavy tractors can't get in to transplant some of our summer crops. Crops like watermelon. Because of the soggy soil, farmers haven't been able to plant it yet. The wet weather makes it difficult to control the weeds and they end up choking the crop. The moist conditions also create the perfect breeding ground for mold. This spring, the crop that was um, most directly affected by the overabundant rain was our strawberries, and they're a very high value crop for us. The fungus that we have in the fields now is called gray mold, and it uh, really loves wet moist conditions. The farm lost 30% of its strawberry crop to fungus and since the organic farm doesn't use any chemicals, the fungus is especially challenging. As we move further into our history at Honeybrook Organic Farm, we're actually finding that um, global weather events are really impacting our farm and other farms like ours uh, throughout New Jersey. So we're learning how to be smarter um, with respect to farming under challenging conditions. That means putting more crops like these blackberries on raised beds. That protects them from being inundated with an overabundance of rain. The good news is the wet weather hasn't affected business at Honeybrook. That's because it's a community supported agriculture farm and members prepay in advance of the growing season. I think that this marketing model really has um, a lot of potential opportunity to help farmers in this time of uh, transition with the weather still be able to um, do economically okay. The rain didn't keep Trenton resident Carol Monahan away from the farm. You're going to slush in the rain no matter no matter what. Here the impact is when you go into the fields to pick, you definitely need your boots on. The National Weather Service predicts sunny, warm temperatures for the rest of the week. That's something Honeybrook Organic Farm is counting on. In Pennington, I'm Lauren Wonko for NJ Today.